the question is to block uh, shown in figure start from the rest the horizontal plane and the pulley f are frictionless and the pulley is assumed to be to be a neg uh, negligible mass determine the acceleration and tension of the each block and curve now uh, the mass of the block a is uh, 100 kg which is placed in a horizontal plane uh, this is a frictionless plane horizontal plane is a frictionless plane and attached by a pulley which is uh, assumed to be a uh, negligible mass and the also frictionless and the block uh, b is uh, connected in the pulley at point c or the uh, mass of the block b is 300 kg now we have to determine the acceleration of uh, block a and the acceleration of block b also the tension of uh, core t1 and t2 so now solution first uh, the length of rope used in pulley that is uh, a d c o is constant uh, let um, this be the x a and uh, this is uh, x b so a d c o is constant or this is uh, a d plus uh, dc plus uh, co is equal to constant or ad is uh, xa plus dc is xb uh, minus xp minus cb plus co uh, will be xp minus cb is equal to zero or is equal to constant sorry or uh, x a plus x b plus uh, x b is equal to constant cause uh, c b uh, is constant and going to lift and subtract it and become a constant or um, x a plus 2 x b is equal to constant now differentiating both side we get b a with respect to time b a is equal to uh, b a plus 2 b b is equal to zero and again differentiating we get a a plus two uh, a b is equal to zero so this implies uh, a b is equal to uh, minus a a upon two this is uh, a a upon two moves in downward direction so this is the equation number one now the free bar diagram of block a f b t of block a So weight acts in downward direction and there is no reaction and tension T1. So this is uh, block is moves in this direction. So this is MA A, A. Uh, summation Fx is equal to MA A, A or summation fx is uh, t1 is equal to m a a a or t1 is equal to m a is a 100 kg so 100 a is a equation number one now preferred diagram of block b so tension in a t2 is a tension in upward direction and weight is in downward direction so block move is in a downward direction so this is mb ab or taking upward as a positive a summation uh, fy is equal to minus mb ab or summation fy is a t2 minus wp is equal to minus mb ab or t2 uh, is equal to wb 
minus m b a b this implies w b is a um, 300 into 9.81 minus this is uh, 300 a b so t2 is equal to 300 into 9 point 300 into 9.81 so this is uh, 2943 minus 300 a b so this is equation number second now we get the two equation uh, a b is equal to a a by 2 this is equation number 1 and another is uh, t1 is equal to uh, 100 a a so equation number 2 and another is t2 is equal to t2 is equal to 2943 minus 300 a b so this is equation number 3 now at point c in pulley in pulley at point c at point c figure so this is t1 and this is t1 and this is t2 so clearly t2 is equal to 2 t1 or t2 is 2943 minus 300 a b uh, is equal to 2 into 100 a a or 2943 minus 300 into uh, a b is a a a by 2 from equation 1 is equal to 200 a a or 2943 is equal to this is uh, 150 a a is equal to 200 a a this is minus or uh, 2943 a, a is equal to uh, sorry 2943 is equal to this is uh, 350 a a so a a is equal to 2943 upon 350 so this is uh, 2943 divided by 350 uh, this is uh, 8.4085 meter per second square in uh, this direction and uh, a b is equal to a a by so this is 8.4085 divided by 2 so this is uh, 4.04 meter per second square in downward direction so we calculate s elevation of block a and block b now uh, tension uh, so t1 is equal to 100 a a so 100 into 4.04 uh, sorry 100 into 8.4085 so it is uh, 840.85 newton and the t2 is a uh, 2 t1 is equal to 2 into 840.85 so this is 2 into 840.85 so this is 1681.7 newton so by this way we calculate the uh, tension of uh, tension and the acceleration which is the required answer